Now let's take a look at Pixlr, which is an online web photo editing application. We'll do the same sort of thing. We'll open our massive image and resize it and save it so it's appropriate for the web. Click on Web Apps and launch it. We're going to browse for our file. It's on our desktop, inside practice, images, and this is that very large 4,000 by 2,000 image. Let's open it. It's currently scaled to 23% of its original size because remember it's huge. Let's go ahead and click Adjustments and Resize. Our target is 400 pixels, so we'll change this number to 400. Click Apply. So now we can zoom it in a little bit. We're ready to save it. When we saved it out of Photoshop and we used JPEG Mini Lite, the best quality image was right around 60 to 70 kilobytes. So if we put this at 95%, we're going to get 55 kilobytes. If we go all the way to 100, we're going to go over the top. So we want to hit that 95, 96, 97 range to get the same size file. So let's save this as Alaska 96, put it on the desktop. Let's do it one more time. Alaska, this time let's go all the way down to 15 kilobytes, or about 53. Click Save. And now let's take a look at those two images. Here's the 96 one. You can see the sky looks pretty good. 53 one. It's getting a little bit of banding, but not much. A little bit more blur around the faces of the individuals. Part of that's though because I've zoomed it in. So this is doing an awesome job of compressing our image all the way down to a file size of 16 kilobytes. So it looks great and it's extremely small. So very good performance by Pixlr. So this is our original Alaska JPEG. It's huge. It's unusable. Let's throw in the garbage. We've got this one. And we've got this one to work with. Let's go ahead and take the smaller one, put it back in our images folder. Let's change the name to just Alaska. And if we open our index, there's the new image. Now in order to test it, we need to upload it. Pull up Cyberduck, open our sandbox, take everything in the sandbox and delete it. Now we could have just replaced the image, but this is just safer. Drag everything over. It's done. Open our browser. Go to our sandbox. There it is. Pull up the Y slow speed checker. Run the test. Our total weight now has dropped all the way down to 17.3K, which is acceptable. 